Whenever there are misunderstandings with both couples, I think it's not easy to settle it when they are from different cultural backgrounds. You understand? Mm -hmm. So, for instance, an ethnic guy married to an ethnic girl, at times when there are issues, they can understand themselves. You understand? Then an Igbo guy now going to marry a Yoruba guy. You know, at times, this uh, Yoruba lifestyle, as we all know, is a party party things. The guy may not be able to flow with what is happening on their back, in their background. You understand? Likewise to the Igbo guy too. And so when it goes with an Igbo guy to an Igbo girl, at times the flow is easy because they understand the concept from the background. You know, mostly the, the background we come from. Like maybe you are from the middle beds, precisely Benue State or so. You wanted to marry from the Igbo. Most of the family will say, ah, we don't want you to marry from the Igbo. Maybe they might not understand your language and you will not understand them. Many will say they are, they are marriage, uh, whatever, is high and all those things. It affects a lot. And if you said, okay, to the Yoruba people, they will say, no, culture, this and that, that we have a higher culture system than their own. When you get married to them, they might be going out different from your own and all those things. So that affects a lot. I, yes, I think it affects uh, mainly like you said, uh, for the uh, like Idomans or maybe those thieves in Benin State, if you should marry a thief person, they believe the girl or the woman goes out to like to shit on your wife or something. And for the Igbos, when you go, if you should marry the, then they feel maybe during their, if they want to give them any shift and uh, tie to, they will say, okay, no, they will not because she's not from uh, the, their own side. So I think it's a fair, but if you should look at it in a normal reason. Well, personally, I don't think, but I believe that it's individualistic, as in everybody have different um, individual differences. So some people might not see it as something, but other people might see it as something. But personally, I think um, it doesn't really matter. Uh, what really matter is love. So as long as the love exists between the two people we are talking about. so. Uh, cultural background doesn't have say, so it's love that supersedes. I don't think uh, cultural background should affect um, um, people's relationship uh, because in the 21st, uh, 21st century, people should be able to love according to your feelings. Being the Yoruba and Igbo does not mean anything. All you needed in a relationship is just the understanding. Once you can be able to study the person very well, and her character aligns with yours, it can start like a dating from dating to courtship from courtship, then to a serious relationship. And then once you can be able to you find out that everything can work well for you, then you can go ahead into the relationship. So this idea of this, I think in this modern time, we should not be talking about cultural background affecting our relationship with people. <laughs> Yeah, your body just keeping diamonds.